So, welcome back to part 2 of the Modeling Toolbox Tutorials. Now we will have a look at the coding tools. Currently we have three tools. The Code Cleaner, the Offset Calculator and the Position Calculator. So we will start with the Code Cleaner. This is a really nice tool. This was the first one I created. So if you export your code, this is my Leopard 2 tank. If you export the two code as Turbo Model Thingy, I'll do it now, and open it, you see the code is really filled with many many stuff, and you have to rename all parts by hand, and so on and so on. So, if you now simply copy. the code of the parts you need and paste it to this input box here you got the cleaned code and the model of you will know it automatically correct all parts, renumber them rename them delete unused stuff like the zeros the mirror like the false all this stuff is deleted and you only have the blank code over here we have um, two selectors one for where you can change the number where you start so if you already have let's say 90 elements and you will start with number 91 you can also do that and clean code and you see it starts now at number 91 and you got a complete number of 214. In the second you can choose what type of element you want. Okay, let's say a gun model. So now we have a gun model. That's all about the code cleaner. The second tool in this row is the Offset Calculator. Some of you have noticed if you have a problem with your zero point, which is also the rotating point of, the, of your plane or of your car, you have to, choo uh, to change this rotation point or you build the model and notice, damn it, the model is inside the ground. For this problem, I have built a Zs a tool. Now let's take um, this one here. So if you have noticed your model is inside the let's say the surface because you have built it too low just simply take the code, copy it and paste it here. And if you are to low, let's say about 10 blocks, you will see here we have a minus 8, here we have a 2. This tool will add or increase or decrease the positions by the numbers you put in here. So if you want to move the the report you have only to look where should it be. Let's say it will be 50 more to the front. So as you can see now we have 20 here, 70 here. And it made it for all other parts as well. So that's all about this tool. And last in the row is also a new one, Position Calculator. Some of you have noticed that the coordinates used in a Techni are not the coordinates used in the config files, especially for wheels, gun positions, for the passenger positions. You have a, a complete other 
set of coordinates. This is to change between Techni and config coordinates. So you just put in here the coordinate you have in Techni. Let's calculate and you get the string you need for the config file. Also you have the position from the config. Let's say and want to calculate it back to a normal technique coordinate. Here we go. So that's all about this 